Welcome to our channel. Today, we're exploring a unique aspect of America's demographic landscape by focusing on the 10 whitest states in the country. We'll delve into the historical, cultural, and social factors that contribute to the predominantly white populations in these states. This isn't just about numbers, it's about understanding the fabric of these communities. Let's get started. Number 10, Nebraska. Nebraska, located in the heart of the Midwest, is known for its agricultural prowess, friendly communities, and wide open spaces. Nebraska is a fascinating blend of history, culture, and natural beauty. In the mid-1800s, the Homestead Act of 1862 opened up the land for settlement, attracting a wave of immigrants from Europe. Germans, Scandinavians, Irish, and Czechs flocked to Nebraska's fertile plains, eager to claim their piece of the American dream. This influx of settlers laid the groundwork for Nebraska's predominantly white population. Over the years, Nebraska's population has grown steadily, though it remains one of the less densely populated states. With just under 2 million residents, the state's wide open spaces contribute to its rural character and close-knit communities. The state is heavily reliant on agriculture and manufacturing, sectors that historically have not attracted large numbers of international immigrants compared to industries like tech or finance. This has contributed to the state's demographic stability. Nebraska boasts a rich cultural heritage. Festivals celebrating German, Czech, and Scandinavian traditions are common, and the state's history is deeply intertwined with Native American cultures, which are honored through various events and museums. In recent years, Nebraska has seen a gradual increase in diversity, with growing Hispanic and African American communities contributing to the state's cultural mosaic. Cities like Omaha and Lincoln are becoming more diverse, offering a glimpse into Nebraska's evolving demographic landscape. Today, Nebraska is around 87.5% population white, making it one of the whitest states in the nation. Number 9. Montana Known for its breathtaking natural beauty and vast open spaces, Montana is also one of the whitest states in the USA. Located in the northwestern region of the United States, is renowned for its stunning scenery, outdoor adventures, and rich history. Montana's demographic profile is a reflection of its historical settlement patterns and cultural heritage. Montana's demographics have been shaped by waves of European settlers in the 19th and early 20th centuries, primarily from places like Germany, Ireland, and Scandinavia. These settlers came seeking opportunities in mining, agriculture, and the burgeoning railroad industry. It's important to note that Montana is also home to a significant Native American population. There are seven federally recognized tribes in Montana, and they have a rich cultural heritage that is an integral part of the state's identity. Montana's appeal goes beyond its demographics. With stunning national parks like Glacier and Yellowstone, a plethora of outdoor activities, and a strong sense of community, it's a place where people of all backgrounds can find a home. In recent years, however, Montana's cities like Billings, Missoula, and Bozeman have seen increased diversity, with people moving in from various parts of the country and the world, attracted by the state's natural beauty and quality of life. Today, Montana is around 88.7% population white, making it one of the whitest states in the nation. Number 8. Iowa Iowa's landscape is characterized by rolling hills, fertile plains, and winding rivers. Known for its agricultural prowess, the state boasts endless fields of corn and soybeans, contributing significantly to the nation's food production. Iowa was home to various Native American tribes, including the Sioux, Iowa, and Meskwaki, who thrived in the region's rich natural environment. European settlers arrived in the early 19th century, drawn by fertile soil and the promise of new opportunities. The state played a pivotal role in the westward expansion of the United States. Iowa's culture reflects its diverse heritage, blending influences from its Native American roots, European settlers, and more recent immigrant communities. European immigrants, particularly from Germany, Scandinavia, Ireland, and the Netherlands, flocked to Iowa, drawn by the promise of fertile land and new opportunities. Today, Iowa's population is predominantly white, reflecting the ancestry of those early European settlers. The state's culture and community life are deeply influenced by these roots, which is evident in its festivals, architecture, and local traditions. Beyond its demographics, Iowa offers a wealth of natural beauty, including scenic rivers, state parks, and the iconic Lois Hills. Outdoor enthusiasts and nature lovers flock to Iowa to explore its hiking trails, 
fishing spots, and recreational opportunities. Today, Iowa is around 89.8% .8 population white, making it one of the whitest states in the nation. Number 7. Utah Utah is located in the western United States and is famous for its diverse and breathtaking landscapes, from towering red rock formations to lush forests and sparkling lakes. Utah is also renowned for its breathtaking natural beauty. With five national parks, countless hiking trails, and world-class ski resorts, it's a paradise for outdoor enthusiasts. Utah's demographics are shaped by its history and culture. The state has a strong Mormon heritage, with over 60% of its residents being members of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. This cultural influence has played a significant role in the state's population trends. Today, Utah is not just about its past. The state is evolving with a growing economy, diverse job opportunities, and a booming tech sector, often referred to as the Silicon Slopes. While Utah is known for its predominantly white population, it is important to recognize the growing diversity within the state. In recent decades, Utah's larger cities like Salt Lake City, Provo, and Ogden have seen increasing numbers of Hispanic, Asian, and Pacific Islander communities. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, over 90% of Utah's population identifies as white. This makes Utah the state with the highest percentage of white residents. So while Utah may be known as one of the whitest states in America. Number 6. Wyoming Known as the Equality State, due to its historic role in women's suffrage, Wyoming is a treasure trove of natural beauty, fascinating history, and unique culture. Located in the Mountain West region of the United States, Wyoming is the 10th largest state by area, but the least populous, with just over 580,000 residents. This means plenty of room to explore and enjoy the great outdoors. The history of Wyoming is rich with stories of pioneers, cowboys, and Native American tribes. The state's demographic makeup has been influenced by waves of European settlers during the 19th and early 20th centuries, who were drawn by the promise of land and opportunity. One of the biggest draws to Wyoming is its natural beauty. From Yellowstone National Park to the Grand Tetons, the state offers endless opportunities for outdoor recreation. In recent years, Wyoming cities like Cheyenne, Casper, and Laramie have seen a gradual increase in diversity. People from various backgrounds are drawn to Wyoming for its natural beauty, economic opportunities, and quality of life. According to the latest census data, Wyoming has the highest percentage of non-Hispanic white residents in the country, with over 92.3% of its population identifying as white. Number 5. Idaho Idaho is located in the Pacific Northwest region of the United States, bordered by Montana, Wyoming, Utah, Nevada, Oregon, and Washington. With a population of around 1.8 million people, Idaho is known for its vast wilderness areas, agricultural prowess, and a significant majority of non-Hispanic white residents, comprising about 82% of the state's population. El Dajo, known for its vibrant downtown, Boise combines the amenities of a city with the charm of a small town. The Boise River Greenbelt, a 25-mile tree-lined pathway, offers beautiful views and outdoor activities right in the heart of the city. Idaho's natural attractions are some of the most stunning in the country. The Sawtooth National Recreation Area offers over 700 miles of trails, pristine lakes, and jagged peaks. In the 19th and early 20th centuries, European settlers moved to this region for mining, agriculture, and later, the tech boom. These early settlers were mostly of European descent, and their descendants still make up the majority of Idaho's population today. The state's geography and economy have also played a role in shaping its demographics. According to the latest census data, Idaho's population is over 92.6% white. This is significantly higher than the national average, where around 60% of the population identifies as white. Number 4. New Hampshire New Hampshire, located in the New England region of the northeastern United States, is bordered by Maine, Massachusetts, Vermont, and the Canadian province of Quebec. It's known for its expansive forests, the White Mountains, and its significant role in American presidential primaries. New Hampshire, like much of New England, was settled by Europeans in the 17th and 18th centuries, primarily English Puritans. Over the centuries, this demographic trend continued. These early settlers established farming communities, towns, and industries that became the foundation of New Hampshire. 
The descendants of these settlers still make up the majority of the state's population today. The influx of new residents is slowly changing the cultural landscape of New Hampshire. From cultural festivals to new businesses and cuisines, these changes are enriching the state's cultural tapestry. New Hampshire's demographics also impact its political landscape. The state is known for its independent streak and swing state status in national elections. However, the predominantly white population means that issues related to racial diversity and inclusion may not always be at the forefront of political discussions. Today, New Hampshire's communities reflect this historical pattern. The state's small towns and rural areas are predominantly white, with many residents tracing their ancestry back several generations. According to the latest U.S. Census data, New Hampshire's population is approximately 92.6% white. This makes it one of the least racially and ethnically diverse states in the country. Number 3. West Virginia West Virginia, nestled in the Appalachian region of the United States, is known for its mountainous terrain, coal mining history, and rich cultural heritage. With a population of about 1.79 million people, it stands out not just for its scenic beauty, but also for its demographic makeup. The region was initially settled by European immigrants, primarily of English, Scottish, and Irish descent. These early settlers established small farming communities in the Appalachian Mountains, which remained relatively isolated from the rest of the country. The late 19th and early 20th centuries brought significant changes with the rise of coal mining. Immigrants from Southern and Eastern Europe, as well as African Americans from the South, moved to West Virginia seeking work. West Virginia's rural nature also plays a role in its demographics. Rural areas in the United States tend to be less racially diverse than urban centers, with over 50% of its population living in rural areas. West Virginia's natural attractions are some of the most stunning in the country. The New River Gorge, now a national park and preserve, offers breathtaking views, world-class whitewater rafting, and numerous hiking trails. According to the latest census data, West Virginia is one of the least racially diverse states in the country. Over 92.8% of its population identifies as white, making it the whitest state in terms of percentage. Number 2. Vermont Vermont, located in the northeastern part of the United States, has a fascinating history that dates back to its colonial roots. It was not only one of the first states to be admitted to the Union after the original 13 colonies, but also played a pivotal role in the American Revolution. Vermont is renowned for its stunning natural beauty, which attracts visitors from around the world throughout the year. The state is dominated by the Green Mountains, part of the larger Appalachian Range, offering breathtaking vistas, hiking trails, and opportunities for outdoor recreation. Vermont's demographic history dates back to its early settlement by European immigrants in the 17th and 18th centuries. These settlers, predominantly of English, French, and Scottish descent, established farming communities and small towns across the state. Vermont's economy, historically centered around dairy farming, maple syrup production, and small-scale industries, attracted fewer immigrants compared to urban centers and industrial regions. The demographic makeup of Vermont also influences its political landscape. The state is known for its progressive policies and active civic engagement, which are shaped by its predominantly white, well-educated population. As of the most recent census, Vermont's population is overwhelmingly white, with over 93.8% of its residents identifying as non-Hispanic white. Number 1. Maine Located in the northeastern corner of the United States, Maine is bordered by New Hampshire, Canada, and the Atlantic Ocean. With a population of approximately 1.4 million people, Maine is predominantly non-Hispanic white. Maine's largest city, Portland, embodies the state's coastal charm with its historic architecture, bustling waterfront, and vibrant art scene. The history of Maine is deeply intertwined with its maritime heritage. From fishing villages along the coast to shipbuilding industries that once thrived in towns like Bath and Belfast, Maine's coastal communities have shaped its economy and culture. Maine's demographic landscape traces back to its early settlement by European colonists, predominantly of English and Scottish descent. These settlers were drawn to Maine's fertile lands and abundant natural resources, establishing communities that have persisted over centuries. Maine boasts some of the most breathtaking natural landscapes in the country. Acadia National Park, with its granite cliffs, scenic coastal trails, and Cadillac Mountain, offers unparalleled views of sunrise and sunset. Today, Maine's population remains predominantly white, 
With many residents proud of their deep-rooted heritage and connection to the land, the state's small towns and coastal communities reflect a sense of unity and shared history among its residents. According to recent census data, Maine's population is predominantly white, with over 93.9% .9 identifying. This is significantly higher than the national average. And there you have it, the 10 whitest states in America. These states are not just about their demographics, but are also rich in culture, natural beauty, and community spirit. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to your channel name for more interesting content. See you next time.